All right. Yes. Recording in progress. Okay, cool. Hello, hello, and welcome to the Simply M Spotlight, hosted by Simply M The Movement. My name is Vanessa Castillo, and I am the founder and CEO of The Rich Girl Mindset, and I will be your co-host this afternoon. The Simply M Spotlight is a special new series where we will feature special guests on various topics that will enrich, educate, and inspire the community here at Simply M The Movement. We are thrilled to have you join us today as the founder and CEO of Simply M The Movement and your Simply M Spotlight host, Keri Urbe, will be interviewing self-care coach, wellness consultant, and founder of Holistic Transformations, Shirley Julianne Bolden. A little bit about our host and special guest. Keri Urbe was born in Cuba and raised in Miami, Florida. Her desire to bring the healing and transformative power of music and movement has birthed her new community, Simply M The Movement, which is on a mission to change the way women use and incorporate creativity, dance, music, and their daily lives. By providing virtual and in-person dance classes that are simply easy, simply fun, and simply inspiring. Shirley Julianne Bolden, aka Jali, is a licensed massage therapist and has her master's degree in arts education. For the past 14 years, she's been providing therapeutic massage and body work specializing in essential oils. Her brand, Holistic Transformation, provides education on how essential oils and other natural practices can enhance one's self-care regimen. They provide tools and services to people suffering from chronic pain, as well as anxiety and chronic stress. Shirley has the honor to teach others about the importance of making their wellness a priority. So needless to say, I'm super excited to be alongside these two powerhouses today, and it is time to get this interview party started so on behalf of Simply M, the movement, we thank you for being here with us this afternoon. And yeah, let's have some fun. Yes, let's have a great time. Thank you, Vanessa. Yes. Thank you, Shirley, for being here. And thank you, Eveline, for also joining us today. Um, we are recording this, so that way we can share this with other people across all platforms um, through Simply M, the movement and holistic transformations. Yes, so important to get these messages out. So before I give the floor to Shirley, I do want to say I'm part of your self-care crew. And this is, <laughs> and this is one of the lip glosses. Oh, I'm missing out. <laughs> one of the lip glosses that you sent me. Yes, girl. Okay. Like Ooh, this is amazing. <laughs> it really is. And I tell, I tell my friends all the time, I'm like, I don't even go to the grocery store, okay, <laughs> with naked lips. And these like these lip glosses are so incredible. The the color stays on like for real. It doesn't stick. And it I don't know. It's just like this perfect balance. So mm -hmm. anyhow, Shirley, we've been friends for a really long time. Yeah. I love you so much, and I I'm so grateful not only for your friendship, but for your inspiration as a female entrepreneur, as a healer, as someone that really gives so much of herself to others and always has and everything you've ever done. We've had the opportunity to work together for a very long time um, when we were at spring chickens. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still Which a spring still chicken. I'm about <laughs> That's right, Shirley. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, <laughs> And so anyhow, so I am a part of your self-care crew. I want you to, to share what prompted you, what really moved you, because I'm all about that movement. What moved you to start your self-care crew and take that full dive into helping women in this area of their lives? Thank you for that great question, Ketty. I first want to say thank you, Vanessa, for that awesome introduction. And Ketty, thank you for creating this spotlight. It is a great venue to share our information and our business and empower women. So to answer your question, um, back in the 90s, I started working with women and young girls, and Ketty worked with me for a long time, and empowering women and young girls to make good choices, to make choices for their lives. And we used arts 
as a way, a safe space to practice making choices where there are no right or wrong choices in art. So that was a great experience. And we use a lot of movement. That was, we use creative writing and drawing, but movement was the core of our work. And it was just always so inspiring to talk to those women, to get their experience, to get how this benefits them. And so self-care has always been a, a, a challenge for me. Then after that, I moved into massage, massage therapy, and um, working in spas and working, it's like massage became this kind of um, luxury, right? Instead of looking at it as self-care. So you have to have, you know, you have to have money and time and all of these extras to be able to practice self-care. So more and more things started coming in as teaching, seeing the people that would come into the offices for massage weren't always working women or women like us, right? Just busy, busy and save it for the vacation or we save it for that one weekend where we absolutely need a massage or our bodies in pain. And so this and many things prompted me to create this business. At first it was primarily massage, right? Because that's my thing, massage. But then after the pandemic hit, I couldn't touch my clients, like literally couldn't touch them. Right. But yeah. you know, and the phone calls helped and the consulting helped. And oh, by the way, I have a, an essential oil that's going to help. And so then I just like, you know what? I think I can create a venue where women can virtually tap in and on any level that they can and can afford and time that they can afford and really learn different tools and different things to enhance their self-care. Because I feel like self-care may be a challenge for many professional women, right? Yeah, yeah, many of yeah. us struggle with it. And so Absolutely. why not have a team, a crew that's constantly motivating you or giving you tips or girl, I did my walk today or I'm drinking my water really to kind of help cheer us on, uh, cheer you on in your self-care journey. Yeah, so absolutely. That's why I created the self care group. The self care so important. Yeah, it is, and I think something important um that I want to touch on about your 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 business about holistic transformations is honestly your products, and it's not like I'm not like pushing this or selling this or whatever. And so my entire life. I couldn't walk into like a Bath and Body Works. I don't know about any of you or whatever without coming out with like a gazillion creams because I love smell. I mean, right. this was a long, I'm dating myself, but like a yeah. long time ago. And I was like, oh my God, I have a problem. But now thanks to you, I realized that I don't because now I know because of everything you share through your newsletter and our self-care crew and all that is how important this, like the this, uh, sense of smell how interconnected it is mm -hmm. and then now it's like now I get why all those things would just it just felt good right like it just would heal my soul so your body butter your scrubs the um roll-on the spray mist like truth be told when I do this routine with it and the scents are just so amazing and the quality is just so good it's like a ritual it's like I get in a zone right and that's kind of like it's more than just I want to hydrate my skin or I want to exfoliate is what I'm trying to say it's kind of like I am kind of worshiping my body and and nourishing it and also just really taking my mind to another place just through those smells and those scents so can you tell us a little bit about you don't have to give us your secret but like all that love and all that knowledge because you do them yourself, which I think also takes it to another level. Like this is so much love that you pour into it. So tell us how you kind of stumbled on that, your little chemistry project. I love that. I love that. So as a massage therapist, I've struggled with finding the perfect medium, right? The perfect lubricant to use on the body. Sometimes mm -hmm. it's too much glide. Sometimes it's not enough. And then sometimes they have parabens and all kinds of cancer causing okay. ingredients or problematic ingredients. I did find one that I like, but during the pandemic, <laughs> I was like, can I come up with something like in the lab playing? I've never had the time to do that before. <laughs> so I decided to get some butters, shea butter, mango butter, all the different ones that I like to all use. All the butters. 
and put them together. And I started researching the benefits, like mango butter is great for the skin, high in vitamin E. Shea butter is great for the skin as well. Uh, Rosehip oil, um, what's the one? It's vitamin E. I put vitamin E right in there, you know? Um, and um, what else do I use? And then I use my lavender, my Young Living lavender essential oil in some of the products. My Young Living, I think, is what takes it to another level. Mm. Young Living is high quality, therapeutic grade. It's so it's so um, pure that you could take it right now. I could put it right in my in my and tea and take it internally. Where they usually tell you most of the essential oils you shouldn't take oh. it internally. So right. this brand, I really, I've been behind this brand since 2007. So playing around with it in the lab and I created this awesome body butter where before some body butters I used were kind of thick. I was like, let me blend it. <laughs> so I use my hand mixer and I blend for 30 minutes. Okay, that's the love you're feeling. I'm like, that's the love right there. <laughs> I'm telling you, you do. You really do. I'm not just saying that. <laughs> and it melts. Like I try it and it melts mm. right on your skin without I'm that enrolled. Kind of greasy. Say again. I'm enrolled. <laughs> <laughs> listen I, like like for real I, and this is no joke I want some I, on right now like I, sound, I know I sound I know I sound crazy but let me tell you so I put Shirley's holistic transformations body butter on my legs you don't understand I just go to my mom's house I don't go anywhere without like putting on the products morning and night and everyone's always like your legs look amazing I'm like yeah because, and they're like, oh my God, it's like this perfect, like you said, it's like this perfect balance of like, not too shiny or, you know, whatever. And it, and it feels so good. So good. Um, and I know that maybe that sounds superficial, but again, I just want to bring it back to, I'm always in a rush, right? Like I got to a point in my life when showering, you would think that I was like a horse in a stable where someone was just hosing me down. Like, all right, you know, time to de gato. yeah, yeah, totally. Baño de gato, like us Cubans say, like cat shower. Like I wasn't even <laughs> enjoying my shower time. And when I joined your self-care crew and getting your newsletters and getting your products, it's like, I slowed down, you know, even if it's like five extra minutes and it really does make a difference. And it's kind of also too, I remember at one point I was very unhappy I was very disconnected with my body and unhappy with it. And us women, we go through this so much in and out during our lives. And I remember my um, therapist told me, I want you to like, as you're bathing, as you're putting on whatever, to love your body, to like speak to it or whatever. And, and I remember it felt so weird. But when I started doing my little rituals again with your products, I remembered that. And so now when I do it, I really put this intention behind it that it's a, it's more than just body butter or whatever. It's about me taking time to honor my body, to, to just make myself feel good, to smell nice and to know I'm doing something just for me. And it can sound silly. I don't know to some people, but it's really made a difference to how I start and how I end my day, which sometimes when I get home, I don't even feel like a human being. Sometimes I'm so overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, you know, you bring a really good point about intention because for so many of us, well, I'll speak for myself. There was a while self-care was Saturday. I go get my hair done, my nails done, my eyebrows done. Yes. That's my self-care. Yes. If, mm -hmm. if I'm lucky, I get a massage. Um, but those are all things for like the world yeah. to see me, right? <laughs> and now the- That's like maintenance. Right, maintenance, right? <laughs> in the world, right? <laughs> but now it's like um, with the intention of self-care of how you're, you, you know, using that body butter or when you use that body butter. Like there was a time where I would go to bed with, without putting anything on my skin. Nobody's going to see my ashy legs while I sleep. But now it's about caring for my skin. Invest exactly. Investing I now. Think, I think even with the getting the nails done and stuff, if you go with the intention of yeah. it being self-care and you're truly present and in the moment and like really taking it in then that's another level of self-care but if we're I just like agree. you know I just there whatever agree. on the phone not yeah. caring then yeah. that's a whole right. different level it's the intention <laughs> yes. it's the intention, it's the intention. And, and also so what you've created in in my opinion for me and and you've been this friend for me when 
I speak to you, you, I want to touch on this topic. You always remind me about how we, we can rest, how rest is something that's so important, you know? And you always tell me, Katie, you have permission to rest. You know, resting isn't a luxury. Like you were saying earlier, self-care shouldn't be a luxury. Um, and I heard this um, author, I can't remember her name now, so I apologize, but if anyone can look it up, and 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 find her she was on a podcast that I was listening to and she was talking about how rest is the new revolution it's a new resistance and basically and I don't want to like chop up what she said but what she was basically explaining was that this hustle mentality this grind mentality mind you we're entrepreneurs of course we're, we're doing things we, we want to feel productive and with purpose but not being in that rat race right and actually taking a stand which is what I felt like I was able to do with the support of your self-care crew is, is say, I don't have to shower in a rush. I don't have to do these things in a rush. And I can make this a daily part of my life, even if it's just five or 10 minutes, because it gives a message to my brain. Yeah. Have you had women that have shared with you from the crew that have told you, Shirley, as soon as I joined your crew and I started doing this, this is what changed. Like, Tell me about that butterfly effect, just like your logo of what you've started. I've gotten different um, feedback from different women. Um, some of the women that I've worked with, sleep has been an issue. So I'm getting the feedback that sleep is becoming easier, mm. the different tools. Um, and then um, also skin issues, eczema. Like one of my clients, her daughter had deals with horrible eczema. And so getting a little sample <laughs> of the body butter, even when they run out, she can keep it in her purse. So that really helps alleviate the itching and alleviates the e eczema. That in itself, those two things. And another one of my favorite is hydration. So actually a, a member taught me about this. Because mm. talk drinking water regularly has been a challenge for all of us. And we talked about it in, in our lives, like sitting at the desk or working, how do you make sure you get your water, you know? And this yeah. is a thing for teachers. And so one of them was like, well, let's get like these things where you have the time. I don't know if you have one, Ketty. And I you do. like, yeah. And you try to meet the times. And this has been a great gift for me. Right. So I got this from a member and I share it with the other with the other members, too. So just in those three things, it's like, OK, this is a great value. This is a great value. And I need to keep keep it going. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, and it's it's relatable. I love that you do. I also want to say that like getting excited around self-care. So you do uh, giveaways. She does. So, you know, Vanessa, every month she does like, you know, different giveaways and different um, ways for us to all get engaged in it. Love it. And I love that because it's kind of like gamifies the whole process. Yep. Um, and I want to make sure, Shirley, that you share about how people can join your crew because A, it's so affordable you make everything so relatable. These are all real women, just like us that have a million different, you know, things that they're doing, moving parts, moving parts, you know, helping each other out, supporting each other. And you're sharing these beautiful products. These, um, these great products that you make yourself. So tell us, you know, so everyone knows how to find you, how to join your self-care crew. Absolutely. Before I do that, I do want to hit on a couple of things. Yes, <laughs> yes. Sure. hit us. Uh, yes. So self-care looks different for everyone. Self-care is as individual as your fingerprint. It just is not a, a cookie cutter situation. However, there are certain aspects that look the same for everyone, which includes these three, movement, hydration, and sleep. Um, so movement, simply M, is great for that, right? just how to incorporate movement in your daily activity, whether it's 10, 15, 30 minutes, whatever it is. And so um, the next part is hydration, making sure you're sipping on some water, four ounces every hour, right? That's a little tip that's really important. The third one is sleep. Like sleep is so important without sleep or whole day. Like when I don't sleep well, my interaction with my, my family suffers, with my clients, my work suffers, my well-being suffers. So how do we increase the quality of our sleep? 
So one of the tips that we share in the membership is to use your lavender oil in your diffuser. Mm -hmm. So all these little things we focus on in the self-care crew and we modify and um, make each membership really to each person, right? So your membership program looks different from Anel's program or anybody else's program, right? So it's very individualized. And so there's different levels of how much you can afford from $5 a month to $200 a month. The $200 a month, we're holding your hand, we're making your plan, we're checking on you regularly, we're making sure that if you're in crisis, you're coming out of crisis and you have the tools to do that right? All the way to the $50 a month is one of our favorite ones. And you get an essential oil every month. You get an oil every month and you get information about it. You get discounts on different um, product, products. You get information on whatever is the topic of the month, like in our newsletter. And I love the fact sheet. The fact sheet is like fast. You're like, how can I use it? When can I use it? and where, right? And so that also is part of it. And um, we have the $5 membership, which is 17 cents a day about, right? Where right. you get samples. I give essential oil samples. I give my product samples. I give discounts. And, and, and my favorite part, <laughs> my favorite part is I write a hand thank you, Noah, a handwritten letter to every member because there's something special about that thank you. Right. Yes. There's something special about getting a pretty card with something that somebody's been thinking about you. That somebody, you know, somebody and so it took time to like write. Right. And so the crew stands for that. We support each other. It's not just about me supporting you. It's about the entire group feeding each other um, as a community. Because as women, we have to make our care a priority. We're yeah. so good at making a million other things more important Preach than it. us. And so I'm really proud of this crew for coming together when we can, because <laughs> it's tough. But when we can, we come together and we celebrate and just drop gems on how to keep uh, continuing our self-care, to keep our health. And if our health is our wealth, then that's where it starts, right? It starts with our, our health, then all those other dreams and goals and aspirations can come into play. But if we're not healthy, right? Mentally, physically, emotionally, then we get stuck. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Because. And I'm so glad you you brought up your, your cards because yeah, I'm one of those recipients. I love and those. It, and it, yeah, and it, you have no idea. It makes such an amazing oh, difference. Like you always put a beautiful butterfly sticker in them, which I put them on my planner. And I always think of you and I don't know why it's like magic for some reason, every time I read it, it's that moment where I needed the reminder. So it's like you said, it'd be like you know? that. <laughs> yeah. And, and Shirley always writes like a new special note and, and it, it's, and you don't see it anymore. It's true. All you get are texts or emails. And it's that personalized touch. Again, it's back to all that love that you pour into it. And I do, you just said something that reminded me. So the butterfly effect, that, that ripple effect, like your logo, I started, so now because of you, I have diffusers everywhere. I won one in one of the giveaways. It's here at my studio. Okay. <laughs> I have one in my bedroom. I have one in the, in the like living area and in my home office. So anyway, so when I first started doing it, my partner, Julio, was like, oh, that's so cool. Like, what is that? And then my sister didn't really like, my sister does candles, right? So she didn't really do the diffuser. So I got everybody, thanks to you, <laughs> turned on to diffusing. And my sleep, yeah, it's, it's fantastic. I'm, I'm someone who's always suffered from insomnia and your the whole lounger thing it is true that I sleep so much better like, oh yeah that you drop all the time um and it's yeah and I was someone that was sleep deprived like and I remember thinking god I, I would tell people I've tried everything under the sun and it wasn't that I didn't believe you I was just like I don't know if you know if, if I'm just hopeless at this point but no, those, those, uh, essential oils they, that you send us and the lavender for the sleeping is for real game changer. It really is. 
So well, there's a lot of science. There's a lot of research behind those essential oils that people don't know about. People think it's some woohoo thing. And mm -hmm. right. lavender specifically, that's one of my favorites, is really great for stress, anxiety, and um, inducing relaxation and, and rest. So it's all about really science, really the science of, of the there's oil. science behind the woo-woo, guys. I yeah. Mean, yes, there yeah. is. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And what Shirley says <laughs> like is that. true. There there are there are still a lot of like doubters and 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 what have you. And you know, to each his own, you know, to each his own. Um, but I'm with you, Shirley, that that's why I think and I wanted to share what you're doing because you're a beacon of light. For other, especially the younger generation, girl, young girls to see that it makes a difference to everyone when you follow mm -hmm. your path and you want to share with everyone you want to see, you know, like rise, like they say, rising tides lift all boats. Um, and your self-care crew, I, I, I can't say it enough, has really kept me on track. I was completely off track. Um, and I know that it's a community led by a woman that believes in other women so that I, I I am so grateful for you um I just want the I really do want the whole world to to see the beauty of what to you're doing in. to tap in yeah, yeah to be a part of it um and also again making it accessible because I know in our conversations as friends I'm Hispanic you know I what people might think that you know in Miami, you're not a minority. <laughs> I don't know if you remember when you were in Miami, but <laughs> surely. <laughs> I remember. <laughs> yeah. So people think, you know, oh, you're not a minority in Miami. Well, while that might still be the case, it's kind of like you and I have discussed, you know, you know, my parents came with nothing. I don't come from a background. I'm the first business owner in my family. You know, I'm, I'm treading like a new path that, that, you know, no one was able to help me through it. And the same goes for you. Like we've, we're doing this on our own. Um, and I think that that's why it's that much more inspirational because the opportunities, you know, we had to make them, I would say we had to make our opportunity. Yeah. So tell me, is there any last words of, of inspiration for all the women out there that are thinking that self-care is not doable, that there's no way they can make time? Get involved, get involved in something, find a walk group or a book group or a community that focuses on something other than work and productivity, something that's enjoyable, right? Um, our crew is here for you if you need, starting at $5 a month. But if you don't wanna do that, find something that fills your heart. Just find something that you find joyful, right? And do it because when you invest in yourself now, you invest in your future, mm. okay? Yes. Yes. Beautifully yeah. said. Yeah. Find, find your tribe and definitely find people that will lift you up and that are helping you make you like you started off with making better choices. Yeah. Right. And, and that we can choose again, like if today, and sorry, just one last thing, because Keep I going. used to do yeah. it to myself. If I wasn't doing it perfectly, then I would like stop. Right. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Because, because you know, is there a day that I miss my my luxurious routine with your products? Yeah, sometimes there's certain days that are like off the chain, you know. But in the past, I would just stop. Like, oh, you see, you like know. you, like you didn't, you failed. Yeah, yeah, and exactly, and so that's also too why why the 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 circle, the tribe, the crew is so important. And then also too, you introduce new fun things to try. You even include recipes in your newsletter. Yeah. And they're like seasonal. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. And so ha having that adventurous spirit of like changing it up too, like, oh, okay, I hadn't thought of that. Or I can use this this way. So yeah. So ladies, everyone who watches this, whether it's today, tomorrow, a year from now, um, make time for yourself. You. It's important. 30. Yeah. Make time for you. Take care of your body. Love on it. Um, get with women that are going to support you. And, and definitely let's continue to raise awareness around why our health is so important. Like Shirley said. 
Yeah, treat yourself you. like your own best friend or some something that you really, really care about your child, right? That's important to be forgiving to yourself. Be forgiving. It's okay. Yes. It's okay. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Well, let That's me tell you, great. I was Surrender. I was driving, I was driving to the studio here today. It's been a rough week, okay? I mean, I like to like keep it real. It's it's been rough as hell. And yeah. um, and I'm a Pisces, so I gotta feel my feelings. Yeah. <laughs> I was blaming it on I'm feel a those feelings feel those feelings um and you know because of this whole self-care journey it's like I give myself more permission and on the drive over here I was listening to a song that I used to love all the time by seal it's love's divine and it just touched on my heartstrings and I let myself cry like the tears just came down so he you know yeah and I was so excited because I knew I had this interview with Shirley today and with you Vanessa but there's still uh, this this thing inside of me that I, I it's just been a hard week and I needed to give myself like you said be my own best friend and just allow myself that moment and I use music as a way to 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 heal and to connect and now I do it more and more and this is what it's about right um and in the past I just would be like no I gotta be tough right keep going like, don't break down because then I'm going to fall apart but now I know that if I can feel what I'm feeling and allow myself that permission like you said permission to rest permission to feel like you would tell me all the time then now that's really loving yourself right taking care of yourself absolutely absolutely yeah yeah and you're I'm giving such a great you. example it's to it's your to your son I think that's so important to to Michael right. for yeah. boys to see that mommy takes time for herself right yeah yeah because we need the men out there to support women and by yeah. them seeing from a young age mommy takes care of herself too she doesn't only take care of me mm -hmm. um then that means that when he is out in the world around other women he 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 wants and supports women to do the same as he opposed val to he'll, he'll value the woman who takes care of herself exactly I because you saying that yeah Thank yeah, you for saying that. Yeah. Super important because the way that you're raising him um with your husband, of course, but meaning you as the woman giving that example, right? That he sees, oh, mommy takes care of herself. Mommy makes time for herself. But there's things that mommy does that are outside just being a mommy. Mm-hmm. So close to you, girl. Yeah, hats off. I can go on forever. <laughs> Let me give you a little story really quick. So um, when he can't sleep, this is when he was a baby, baby, baby. He couldn't sleep. I put a couple of drops of essential oil and I bought him a little diffuser. It's a little owl that I keep okay. in his room. Now this man cannot go to bed without, <laughs> can I get the essential oil? Can I get the lavender in the owl? So sometimes <laughs> I'm like, look, you're using up all my lavender. So I'll just turn on the, the oil. Up. <laughs> right he's like uh i just put i just turn it on the the oil the owl without putting on the oil oh um, he could tell he could tell you're missing the oil <laughs> he can tell he can tell you you fooling yeah. who you think you're fooling <laughs> so i that's how i know i know it works because the effect it has on children yeah yeah and you wow. know children are real raw and authentic so <laughs> absolutely absolutely but you filter. see that but you see like that's that's so cool that's yeah. so cool. Like, and he recognizes it and it works. Yeah. Other parents are like, here's some Benadryl. <laughs> <laughs> now everyone knows oh. we, we can save the Benadryl for later. Try the Correct. essential oil Try first, oil. okay? <laughs> yes. Get a diffuser and some lavender essential oil. <laughs> Listen, we're saving some children right now. That's right. the way I think. Like, you don't have to drug them. <laughs> you can diffuse. Try, try lavender. <laughs> try that. <laughs> It's a safer route. <laughs> I love it. I love it. Well, thank you, Shirley. On that note, thanks again. I know yes. you're a busy, busy lady. Thank you for taking. Don't forget the time. to tell everybody how they can find you and all of the important information. I'm Absolutely. on Patreon, Patreon, but you can find me at holistictransformationsmassage.com, holistictransformations with an S massage. Dot com and that will have link to my page patreon membership and all the stuff that we offer all the programs that we offer 
Yes. Thank you for Thank reminding you. me, Vanessa. Thank you. Yeah. I didn't want to so ask, is there is there an opportunity for people to ask questions or do we do that? Or yeah, right? absolutely. If Eveline wants to, I didn't want to put her on the spot, but if Eveline wants to ask some questions, that would be awesome. If you want Evie, I or, can still don't put you either, or, but I wanted to offer that if you wanted. Yes, for this sure. Yeah, for Q &A. That'd be great. If or there any, are any cues. Please. No, this was wonderful. Thank you so much. And I too have been a recipient of one of those love notes and it's made my week. So thank you for Love that. It. And yeah, Shirley, please blast this. I'm going to help spread the word as well with this video, just so that people understand how to support women, women of color businesses. We invented self-care and these oils and these naturalistic stuff and I want us to be winning out here um, yes. with how we care for ourselves so thank you for making the time all of you Love that. yes oh, thank, thank you. you thank you for wow. sharing oh, again. yes thank you Eveline thank you it really means so much when we have people join us and and you said that perfectly thank you wow what a blessing you see <laughs> it's like it turns my day around this is why yeah. we're doing this Yep. So we put, we put the info in the chat. Definitely, we'll be putting this on um, the Simply M Spotlight uh, YouTube video catalog. I want all these women to be women winning, like Evelyn said. I'm all about that, and I just I'm just so proud of you, Shirley. I love you to pieces. Keep doing what you're doing, <laughs> and Vanessa, the rich girl mindset. I tell her all the time that I think like she's a millennial. She says she's not. But if she oh, was, she's my favorite <laughs> millennial. Heart, heart. I am a millennial. Yeah, she she figures out all the techie stuff that I don't know how to do. That's why I tell her yeah. that. But um, <laughs> Vanessa's out there making moves too. And that's why we connected, helping women um, just live their, not just their best life, to live their passion and their dreams and to let Therapist other belief. girls know that you can do it. So let's Absolutely. keep doing our thing. Yes, raise the roof. Love you all. <laughs> Raise the roof, share this, and have a blessed day, ladies. Thank yes. you. Well, thank you for this. Thank you, Kenny. Thank you, Vanessa. Thank you, Evie. Thank you. Bye, you all. Thank you, everyone watching. <laughs>